this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to use the cover function and apply surface loads directly on the structure. In the structure tab, there is the cover section. Here, I can define the cover and draw the surface onto my structure. This surface will distribute the surface load onto the supporting elements. In this case, the supports are automatically defined when drawing the cover. So, if I want to apply a surface load, I just select surface load, enter the value. choose pick existing region and my surface load is defined. This surface load will be then distributed to the supporting elements. When defining my cover, I also have the option to select the load bearing direction. In the cover menu, under properties, load bearing direction, I have the option to select monodirectional or bidirectional. If I select monodirectional, I right click on the cover and then select the direction. The load acting on this surface will be distributed to this column the loads acting on this surface to this column, and this column will take this section. By default, FemDesign chooses the supporting structures automatically. I have the option to deselect the Auto Supports option and set my supporting structures manually. If I define the cover, I then have the option supporting structures. I right click on my cover and then I make a multiple selection to define the supporting elements.